what made me write the song? I think it was a bad acid actually. To be honest, I can't remember recording any of it. First I found out about it was when I saw it on YouTube. I'm not bothered when it gets to in the charts. As long as it beats that Blow Patrol. Obviously, beating Blow Patrol senseless would be preferable, but eh, you take what you can get. You know what I mean? Eh! Musical influences. Eh. You have to go for the obvious choices. Eh, Wagner, Beethoven, the Immortal Mozart, and of course DJ Testo. Mm. My favourite song, Dance the Magic Dance by David Boo off the uh, Labyrinth soundtrack. You remind me of the bee, what babe? Bee with pa, what pa? Pa, goo doo, goo doo, you do goo, what? Remind me of the babe! I saw my baby crying hard as babe could cry. Is that enough? First of all, and this is a must, socks must be worn outside of the trousers. Kind of in a Superman style Super bam if you like. The trousers must be worn high, as close to the armpits as possible, to show off the goods to any passing ladies who might be interested. Up to the hat, you might notice I'm uh, slightly of the Jewish persuasion. So technically this is my Yamaka. <sighs> what should you do if you're in trouble with the law? Bolt me, cheese it. I mean, they'll probably be weighed down by the drugs they've stole off me in the past anyway, so you've got a good chance, you know what I mean? <laughs> what would I do if my girlfriend was cheating on me? Personally, I'd demand uh, half of whatever money she was making out of the arrangement. And then I'd drop the... What did I make of the recent... What? The recent election? Alright, oh, aren't I? To be honest, I'm quite disappointed that France elected uh, the right-wing Nicolas Sarkozy. Because uh, he's a staunch supporter of George W. Bush. You see that George W. Bush? He's a rasper and a half! Personally, I think uh, they should introduce a law into Scotland forbidding any guy from wearing skinny jeans with the ass hanging at the top. Because uh, these days when I go out in the pool, I can't kind of tell the guys for the birds. That's resulted in some violent morning after experiences, let me tell you. Whew. The Ned crew are currently serving time for crimes against music. Don't know if they're up for parole here. Yeah. You wouldn't want to meet them, mate, trust me. What are my views in drug legislation? Personally, I think they should legalise all drugs, only for treatment of serious medical conditions. Say, if you've got a nasty wee scalp or something, NHS should give you five grams of ching at least to deal with the pain. <laughs> Salty. Advice to someone struggling financially. Personally, my advice would be try and consolidate all your existing snooker balls into one easy, manageable lump sock. Then go on about Bears Den with it, go nuts, clean the place with it! Having trouble with the neighbours? Sorry, mate, I don't watch that crap. After I've been watching Connie Huck and Blue Peter, I need a wee nap, know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean. Advice to someone trying to find a job? Mm, just do what I did. Make a video yourself, jump about like a fanny. It's worked out alright for me. Not that I've made any money yet, but I've pulled a few times. <laughs> My message out to the world. After much thought and deliberation and more personal philosophies in the world, I would say uh, buy the single and go and see my friend show. <laughs> Mine is a message of shameless self-promotion. 